today does not ever not come. Have you ever known when a day wasn't today? So the promise still remains. Today. So tell your neighbor if you happen to jack up the day. Make sure you repent. Because tomorrow will be today. And you'll have another chance. Somebody. I bear witness with you, sunshine. I do everybody point to her and say, yes, Lord. Do it for her now. Glory. Help us. Shout out of a host. Feel the Holy Ghost. I said, I feel the Holy Ghost. Yeah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Just look at your name and say, your promise still remains as well. It's still alive. Still alive. Instead of God changing his mind, he changed the day. Not the date, but he changed the day to today. I'm done. The man of God has spoken. I'm done, really. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I praise the Lord for your apostle. I praise the Lord for how he's using you. I praise him. For the greater vision that was birthed in your spirit tonight, this day. That's why he said, this is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad. neighbor I will be glad in the day because I got a reason because my future is calling my name and there's a day after this one every hand lifted every hand lifted every hand lifted Every hand lifted and surrender. Lord, I don't understand everything I'm facing and dealing with. But the Holy Ghost told me to tell you, take it. I don't know who that's for. Some warfare, some tears, some pain, some hurt, some disappointment. The Lord told me to tell you, take it. Just take it. He said two things is not going to kill you and you won't die because of it. I'm going to say it again. It's not going to kill you and you won't die because of it. Just tell your neighbor, take it. Well, you don't know what they said to me. And you don't know what they saying about me. And you don't know the lie they told. And you don't know how I'm talking. And you don't know. The Holy Ghost said, Take it. It's not going to kill you. It's part of your future. And there's a day after. But Pastor Glenn, you don't understand how heavy it is. I don't care. God say, take it. The burden is not that heavy that you can't carry it. If it was, he wouldn't have never brought it before you. Take it. Because <laughs> you don't want to hold up your future. Because if you don't take it now, you'll have to take it a few days from now. But you was ordained to take it today. Come on, hands lifted. I know you don't get tired. 
Here the Spirit of the Lord said, Renee, tell them I'm strengthening their heart. He's strengthening your heart. He's strengthening your heart. I said, the Lord said he's strengthening your hearts. I feel the power of God. Take, come on, let him do it. He's strengthening your heart. You're not going to die because of this. And you're not going to die in it. And you, it's, it does not have permission to kill you. Just take it. Because there's a day after this. And tomorrow is a better day. What God has for me is for me. That's what you say. And that's so crazy because that's the song that I sung. That's why I'm not, God said, don't kill yourself. The man of God has already spoken. What God has for me, it is for me. I know without a doubt that the Lord will bring you out. What God has for me, it is. Do you believe that? I feel the power of God in this room. Come on, why don't you sing it? What God has for me, it is for me. Yeah. 